All right, gang. Coming at you with the bands today. But not really. Today's after party. Focus on a good bit of bodybuilding work. So what we're looking to do is build our backside. But in a fun way. So we're starting with three giant sets. These giant sets will be nine bent over or dumbbell rows on one side, and then 21 banded good mornings. So then nine bent over or dumbbell rows on the other side, followed by 21 pull points. So all focused on our back, either mid back or upper back, and then focus on our back of our legs with the band of good mornings. So what are we looking for? Looking for in those bent over rows, this flat back position. We can go hands forward if we want to. Grabbing a weight and pulling it back towards our hips. So it's more of a forward and back motion than an up and down motion. So up and down, we build those traps, then we get locked neck and all of those things that we try to avoid. So for those of us with shoulder issues, pain, we can't go all the way overhead, things like that. We really want to focus on building that lat and turning it off. The better we can figure out how to turn our lats on, the better our positioning overhead will be, the better and stronger will be for pull-ups and things like that. Really take that good bent over position, and then roll that back towards your side, just like so. Okay? Then, find a band or something to increase tension on a good morning. So you're going to take a band, put it underneath both feet, pull it up and over onto your back, and then a solid hinge, and then stand up. Solid hinge, and then stand up just like so. Looking to utilize that position, increase the tension at the top of the rep, not just the bottom. You want to see really good hinges up and down here. If you don't have a band or something like that at home, find the weight, and do that same hinge. So you can get it, be your dumbbell bent over rope. And then on the pull parts, Basically, what we're looking to do is a T. So, pinching our scaps and shoulder blades together in a solid squeeze. So, we can do that either with a nice band again, so grabbing it on each end, taking our hands from together, and pulling them all the way apart across our chest. Just like so. We're going to keep our hands at shoulder height and really pinch those shoulder blades back and down together. Now, if we don't have that, we can always use gravity as our resistance force. So we can grab coffee cups, light weights, something like that, hinge the waist again, and then pinch that into a T-shape. Like so. Same motion, same thing, with that band and pull apart there. Okay, get after these giant sets, have a little fun, and build that backside.